Greetings. Hello, everybody. I'd love to introduce to you a little bit about Master Wang Rengong. Rengong Wang is also how he's known. Um, just as a quick tip for information on this, oftentimes people from China, the traditional way they do this in China, and when they come over, they preserve this, is the last name, the surname is first, and then the given name is second. So when you hear Wang Rengong or my teacher Zhou Tsonghua, um, that is actually their surname, their last name that is given first, and that has to do with the importance of the family name regarded by Chinese society, Chinese culture for many, many years. And so Master Wang Rengong will be a 2019 Tai Chi Gala presenter, and he's having a little trouble with his computer right now, so I'm going to be giving this information about him for you. Um, he has an extensive, extensive background. It is amazing. He is a very well-respected martial artist, very well-respected globally, not just in America and not just in China, globally. He's really proven himself. He's also very active in helping to spread the information of not only the internal arts, but of Chinese Kung Fu in general, and really from its traditional roots and from its traditional training, which focused a lot also on the importance of ethics and how you conduct and present yourself in the world. So it's not just about, oh, fighting, fighting, and you know, or, or using your power for selfish means. It's really in a very enlightened way to help you understand how you're part of everything. And it's actually very peaceful. But uh, don't be mistaken, he could, he could get you like a puma. And he's amazing. When you meet him in person, he has this incredible, I don't know how to put it, like an aura about him, a presence about him. And it's, it's like standing next to a puma, like as if a puma just walked up to you and you're like, whoa, you know, and he, he's that intense, but he's not violent. You don't have the, the, the fear of violence in you, but you, you can see the power that he would actually be able to execute and his internal power is so strong. And it's also, being with him is also, um, when, you, when you're in his presence, it's like when you are on the ocean at night and you're on a ship in the middle of the ocean and you look up in the stars and you see how, how far away that is, how, how vast that is and how amazing that is. And then you also look down at the water and you, you see the dark water, but you also know that it's so deep and so limitless and that's really the the incredible feeling you get around him and, and I think that's I think that's really indicative of somebody who's with the Tao who's really connected with the universe and he has that kind of a timeless energy about him it's it's very healing it's very enlightening it's it's um he's very deep so that's that's all I can say about meeting him in person. You can't get that from photos or videos or I, I can't explain it, but anyone who's ever met him knows exactly what I'm talking about. I'm a little bit about his background. Uh, he's the fifth generation lineage holder for Northern Hall Style Plum Blossom Mantis, which is a very powerful Kung Fu form. He's also the third generation lineage holder for Da Chen Chuang Yi Chun under, and I'm gonna say this name wrong, Wang Xunjie, and sixth generation disciple for Sanxi style Xing Yichun and Cheng style Bagua Zhang under Li Tailiang. He's considered a world's leading expert of the mantis, two hand sword, a world leading expert of that. He's the president of International Da Chen Dao and a director on the board of directors for the Civil Aid Society and is a certifying master of the International Kung Fu Federation. Master Wang has been featured in several international martial arts magazines, travels for exhibitions and tournaments, judging and seminars worldwide. Um, he trains stunt fighters for movies, which is kind of interesting, and he is the New York State Director of the World Stunt Association. Master Wang taught both Kung Fu and art. He's also an artist. He's a true um, gentleman scholar. He's an artist too, which is really fascinating. He, he taught uh, Kung Fu and art at the 2006 Mensa World Gathering in Walt Disney World. He's part of Mensa. He's really amazing. 
So he's not just, you know, some people think good kung fu fighters are just all brawn and no brain. He's a lot of brain, too. He's incredible. His short film, yes, he also did a film. His short film called The Lesson won several indie festival awards. And he currently has a school in Elmhurst, Queens, which is a borough of New York City. So if you go on the Tai Chi Gala page, on the presenter page, you will also find his contact information there. If you want to study with him in Queens, New York, or hire him for any kind of things related to martial arts, you can get him at his email, which is Da Cheng Dao, that's D-A-C-H-E-N-G-D-A-O at yahoo.com. And I highly recommend that you get an opportunity to meet him in person because he is amazing. And even though um, his English is a little bit rough, uh, people still say that they learn so much from him. And I think it's because he's very good at showing what he does and he's very personable. So if you have a question, he will, he will help you. You know, he'll help you in person. And you could, for some reason, you can really learn from him. I think he's really good at understanding what you are trying to ask without actually you having to say a whole lot. I think he just can perceive it, and he's very, he's very astute in that. So he can help you, and he's highly respected by martial artists. So people from all walks of martial arts, I've heard personally, um, have said that they've they've made amazing amazing progress just from a few hours with him here and there. So he usually goes to very high level events and we're very lucky to have him at Tai Chi Gala and at a location and at a fee that is incredibly affordable for people to come to. So I highly recommend you do check that out and do take advantage of it or don't have that opportunity. <laughs> He's really amazing. So everything is at taijigala.com. Okay, now let me let me cover a little bit about what he'll be teaching there in 2019. So Saturday morning, he will be doing Zhan Zhuang Hun Yuan standing meditation. And he is amazing at showing how there's so much misconception about meditation out there. It's it's just for me it's sickening because it's sad that people think it just means that you just sit there still and you have to sit there still and if you have ADD you can't do it and you know and all you do is sit there no there's so much more to this from Asia especially from China um, especially through some of these methods that the um, the old Buddhists and the old Taoists use and that are not popularly known so Zhan Zhuang Hun Yuan standing meditation is very powerful not only for cultivating inner peace and transforming the energy of negative emotions into positive and powerful energy but also for getting control of your nervous system and being able to then focus that energy and execute it in very powerful ways. So the Hun Yuan standing meditation has a very sort of round shape, but there's more to it than just the shape. There's a lot to also the shape of the energy and how that can help with healing and also martial arts, which are actually two sides of the same coin. A lot of people don't understand that, but they really are. They're two sides of the same coin. and. Master Wong is, he can, okay, he walks his talk. Let me just put it that way. He walks his talk. He is an, he is a true example of what he teaches. Anything he says, anything he does, he can show it. He embodies it. Sunday morning, he's going to be doing a really fascinating workshop. This is the good one. If anyone has any interest whatsoever in martial arts, he is doing unlocking the martial arts applications in any form. So he's going to teach from universal principle. And I highly recommend that for you if you have any interest or any experience of uh, martial arts. And yeah, if you think you're extremely experienced, you will open yourself up to do new dimensions of thought and new dimensions of doing things just by taking this workshop. If you're a beginner or you're not really sure of what that all means, this is very eye-opening for you. And the thing that I really love about Master Wong is he has such good 
such good martial virtue, such good what what is called wuda, and that's a very hard term to translate properly. It's more than just virtue and how you comport yourself. It goes much deeper into the essence of your intent and who you are. And his environment is always very respectful. So people always feel very welcomed there. They feel very safe there, but it's also very powerful. So it's, um, it's not little, it's not light, it's intense. Uh, it's, it, it, he has some of the most well-attended workshops because he's a very, very high-level master. And so if you can get a chance to work with him, I guarantee you it's pretty amazing, even just to talk with him. And usually even at Tai Chi Gala, he even does some of his custom artwork and sells it there too. So that is such a lovely treat. He will do something usually custom for you. And um, I'll... I'll leave you to discover that yourself. I, w I won't speak too much about that. I don't want to give it all away because he's just, he's amazing. I can't put it all in words. That would really be watering it down. So I hope you will get a chance and investigate this amazing teacher. He's sometimes very hard to get a hold of because he really does travel all over the place. And uh, we look forward to meeting you there and sharing. So take care, everyone and have a wonderful spring. We'll see you.